Equipments are special equipable items that give various stat boosts. And in this video, I'll be talking about the best equipments for every player. A few things you need to know. All equipments have random attributes that cannot be changed. They can range from absolute trash to beyond OP. The attributes can be upgraded using attribute shards. A quick tip. If you've got the NEU mod, you can search for specific attributes you need. And if you've got SBE and NEU, you can look for two attributes at once. Next, you can add various reforges to your equipments. You can also upgrade them using Crimson Essence, which makes them even better. Finally, there are four equipment sets. The Molten set, the Vanquish set, the Thunder set, and the Magma Lord set. For the belt, use an Implosion belt, as it buffs the damage of Hyperion and Spirit Scepter. Also get a Molten belt if you're not clearing during Kudra. For the cloak, use a Vanquished Gas Cloak, as it makes you die less. Molten cloak is also good if you do Kudra. For the necklace, use a Vanquished Magma or Molten necklace. But if you want some of that juicy 60 mana, use a Synthesizer V3. But you'll need to farm a ton of these mobs, which is annoying. For gloves, use a Gauntlet of Contagion, as it will improve your clearing by a lot, especially in F6. For attributes, I'd recommend Breeze and Mana Pool, but they may be expensive, so get Breeze and Life Regen or Speed, which should be much cheaper. For the Reforge, use Fortified if you're struggling to survive. For the Belt, use a Molten Belt, as it's cheap and gives a decent bit of strength. But if you're a high-level player, use an Implosion Belt. For the Cloak, use a Vanquished Gas Cloak, as it makes you die less. Molten Cloak is also good if you do Kudra. For the Necklace, use a Vanquished Magma or Molten Necklace. For Gloves, use a Gauntlet of Contagion, as it will improve your clearing by a lot. For Attributes, I'd recommend Life Regen and anything else, like Speed or Breeze. For the Reforge, use Waxed, if you use a Term or need Crit Chance. Or use Strength or Fortified, if you don't use a Term. For the belt, use a brown belt, as it's easy to get and gives a decent bit of damage reduction. Use a molten belt if you do Kudra. For the cloak, use a vanquished gas cloak, as it makes you die less. For the necklace, use a vanquished magma or molten necklace. For the gloves, use molten bracelet, as it gives decent defense and damage reduction for Kudra. For attributes, I'd recommend life regen and anything else. This is only if you play pure tank or healer. But in dungeons, that probably isn't the case. So use the mage or bird setup depending on what gear you use. Use any one of these, depending on what you can afford. Same for the cloak. For the necklace, use a thunderbolt or delirium necklace, depending on your fishing level. For the glove, use magma lord, if you are fishing 45 and need magic find and sea creature chance. But if you need fishing speed, use any one of these depending on which you can afford. The attributes and reforges don't really matter, but use Fortified if you're struggling to survive. For mining, use a Vanquished Glowstone Gauntlet and an Ancient Cloak. The rest doesn't really matter, but don't forget to get the Glistening Reforge. If you watched the video up to this point, I sincerely thank you. If you want to watch more videos like this, click the button on the left. If you want to continue watching more content, click the button on the right. And don't forget to leave a comment as I read all comments.